to the queen and that'll release her and then she'll start laying eggs and get things going and which the reason you want to do that is it, you want them to take a couple days to get used to her pheromones because this queen's pheromones is what drives the bees and so these bees that are in this hive will only come to this hive because they, they want to go to this very queen that's why you can have hives set up and the, hive, the bees that are in this hive will come to this hive the bees that will come in that hive will go to that hive stuff like that so now we've got her we're going to put this cage in between two frames i'm just going to stick her in here put the frames tighten up the frames the frames are, are three eighths three eighths of an inch apart and that's the that's the width that the bees make between their combs that they travel in that, that's been figured out okay so she's there we're snugging that up okay Okay, and now comes the funnish part. There's Dave. Hi, Dave. You doing okay? You gonna help me out? Dave's here helping me out. I'm gonna take this and move it out of the way, first of all, because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this empty box over the top, just to. to protect the, the bees are going to go on top and the bees are going to be all over the place on top of the frames so this gives them room so I don't squish them so they have room on top when I put the, put the top on there's an inner cover that goes on but I don't, I'm not going to put that on now because the, the frames need to be exposed well, I, because I'm going to dump the bees in and they're going to be all, all So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and give them another spray. Yeah, I'm going to spray a little bit. Spray the frames a little bit. Okay. So, the plan is, I'm going to dump these bees in over on the, the four frame side. And then I'm going to set the box back in because there are going to be more bees still left in the box. I'm going to set that on the five frame side, on the other, away from the queen. And then probably overnight, the rest of them will crawl out or fly out, crawl. And then this this uh, little box here that they came in will be empty, and I'll take it out and I'll put the inner cover on, and then I'll put the top on and then we'll we'll wait three days or so come back check it out the queen hopefully will be out of her cage and laying eggs there's about 5,000 workers which are female but they're, they're sterile in this package and one queen and she'll lay about 1,500 eggs a day <laughs> And then there's a life cycle, of legs, and then they'll, and then they'll hatch and all that stuff. And then she'll just keep laying more, and then they'll hatch, and then it's just a cycle. And you can, you can Google it or go on YouTube. Okay, so here we are. I'm gonna take out the can. I'm gonna pick up the box. I'm gonna flip it over. I'm gonna dump the bees out. There are a bunch of dead ones in here because they died on the trip. They die. There's a, you know, their life cycle is not very long. But with the bee, the wise one will will clean them out of there, and they'll, 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 they'll there'll be a bunch of dead residue of bees at the entrance. Okay, so here we go, gently. I'm gonna go like this. So since I have a bunch of sugar water already in there, see them hanging on there. They're on the bottom eating. So I'm gonna just gonna set this right right in here kind of knocking the bees off gently give it a shake so i can i can tell there's there's a, some syrup still in there so they've got, they've got a little time i need to to fill up their uh their feeder with syrup but i can't i can't get the, the lid off the jar because it's stuck because of the 
the syrup, the sugar water. So I got to soak it in hot water. I don't know if that's going to work. <laughs> so my friend Hong, that I installed, I, earlier I installed a package there. He held one end and I held the other end and he got it. So I'll probably have, I'm going to go over there tonight and we'll, we'll, we'll do that with another one for here. So now these, most of the bees are still in this box. The queen's in her cage. In fact, let me just go ahead and grab the camera here and I'll give you a, I'll give you a close up here. See, so the bees are in there. There's the frame. There's the queen in there. She's in there. They can't get to her and she can't get out. So you need them to get used to this thing. So now I'm going to take this box out of there. I'm going to turn it upside down, give it a shake. Just to get the majority out. And then after that, I'll put the box back in. Put the top on. Call it a night. Can you see me? I'm gonna move that over a little bit. Hopefully the battery won't run out before I'm done. I'm almost done though. Okay, so how we looking? That's not bad. Put my glove on. <laughs> I don't think because yeah, I want to get it done. Okay, so here comes the fun part. Okay. So we'll pick it up gently. We'll just kind of set her here for a second. The thing is, you got to be calm, cool, and collected. That's why I said they're not trying to sting me. I don't need the gear. But with the gear, I'm a little more calm because I'm not concerned that much that they're going to come sting me. Especially when I do this. <laughs> Are you ready? There we go. Now, I want to I do this over there on the other side. Because if I do it on this side, then when I put the box in, it's going to squish it on top. Okay, so here's the front. Just going to turn it upside down. You don't want to drop anything. Now, see, they're going to just go in. See, I'm just dumping them in there. Dumpy, dump, and dump. Okay, so we'll get most of them. I'm going to shake them into the hole, out of the hole. Okay, and give them a pop. And that's not going to make them very happy. Okay, so now there's a lot of them in there. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to sit this right here so I can uh, get the camera and show you real quick. Okay. And what we got there. So they're all dumped in there now. They're going to be to the queen in the cage and they're trying to get to her. So they're going to be eating at that marshmallow. Okay, now tonight they'll all go, they'll calm down, go in there, and then I'll come back out and put the pop cover on, which is that thing right there. Okay, so let's put this back here. Okay. Now, I'm just going to take this, and I'm just going to kind of start up this in, and maybe if I put it up here. Can kind of get the get the bees to move. My wrist is kind of exposed. I hope they don't decide to move to my blood. <laughs> get me. They will. Okay, so we're just going to do this. Actually, I don't want to do that. I don't want to squish a bunch of bees. I'm going to go ahead and put this at the entrance. And then they'll just 